so random too because like we were in bed um watching Terry and <laughs> live with them him her I know they identify as all um <laughs> It was, I wasn't, I didn't know what to expect. I'm going to start my makeup. Um, I didn't really know what to expect, to be honest, because, like, I, I've i seen, the only clip i really seen was the one he showed Madonna in my cup of me. Um, so <laughs> I didn't know really what to expect. I watched, like, about 10 minutes before I decided to, like, request the live. Um, but that was nuts. There was, like, 50,000 people um at one like all, like all at once in there and then like total there was like 3.3 million likes it was like so crazy it was really cool it was really fun I haven't like improv trolled like that in so long and I just I think he's so brilliant in like every way like I, I saw an interview that the creator of Terry Joe Cal Cullen I think is how you say his name you were trying to be an unpopmatic queen well of course you know I love to troll but also I don't you know I like totally he could do it I think he gets away with it that character all of that stuff like that but um, <laughs> of course, me, you know, I was, I was, like, trolling, but also, like, you know, nice trolling these days, you know what I mean? Let's, like, not get canceled for trolling, but, hey, when you're young and stuff, you can, you can do that. I mean, obviously, I don't know, but it was fun, and I think, like, his character is really well loved, and they, and people get it, obviously. I mean, there's, um, an audience that really is there for that, so. It was fun. I thought it was really cool. He showed Madonna and my I love you, Jesus. Um, and what are you doing for New Year's? We're not doing anything, actually. No, we just had Malibu. So we're really not looking to go out. All my New Year's Eves have been horrible, except for last year. We got married in Hawaii on New Year's Eve, which was, like, actually so much fun. Um, <laughs> but I'm here for I'm problematic Trish. Same, same, same. Um, and that was, like, I think the best way with just us two in Maui or our New Year's Eve just us two because it was like such a vibe and it was so fun and we drank and just you know just was totally selfish and it was great and then got pregnant <laughs> so this time last year I was either pregnant or getting pregnant one of the two and it was it was beautiful and I actually had no idea I did I really didn't I didn't expect it to happen so quickly <laughs> Because we had tried for so long, so all of a sudden we're married and boom, pregnant. It was great, but it was, it was a shock. Thank you for my little robot. The line with Terry killed me. Oh, I love that so many of you guys saw it. I didn't know how it worked, so does my followers see it too? I mean, obviously she has like so many more than me, but um, like do my followers see it too? I didn't know how it worked. Morning Trish, good morning, good luck hugs. But it was really fun, and his name's Rory. Rory, feel better soon. Sending so much love, and you'll get through. I pray for your strength, and you're going to make it through. And sorry I look like this, Rory, but yes. <laughs> so... It was fun. It was a good time. I wasn't even looking at the chat because, you know, like, you have to really be on your toes, right? Terry's, like, funny and edgy and you just, I'm trying not to get canceled, but I'm also trying to troll. <laughs> it's just, that's a good time. We celebrate New Year's. Happy New Year's. Oh, my God, we have 8,000 people in here. Wow. Thank you guys so much for subscribing. Thank you for the jellyfish, Mr. Was it Mr. Lasagna? Someone came up with a really good idea and said I should do ASMR eating lasagna dressed as Garfield because Garfield loves lasagna. And I thought that was the best thing ever because I make a really good lasagna. Oh my God, there's 10,000 people in here. I always get nervous when there's like so many. Like, what do I do? Do I sing? I love you, G. You know what? Maybe. Oh my God, there's 10,000 people. What do I do? Oh my God, I get nervous. I don't know what to do. Woo! Hold on one sec. Okay. Any advice going through a rough breakup? Time heals everything. Trust and believe. Makeup sponge is from Hank and Henry. Hank and Henry, but they don't make it anymore. Which is like so annoying. Um... 
Okay. Um, yeah, I think I'm gonna just go with my like, I don't know if I should go with a smoky eye or just kind of like a casual, I think just casual, gosh, I always wanna do something different, but then I'm like, mm, sounds like a lot. I just got my eyebrows down. Uh, I need to get them done again, apparently. What's this? Hamsa, Hamsa, did Hamsa, is that what he put in his? Oh my gosh, my, I'm charging and Hamsa, Hamsa, Hamsa. Oh yes, thank you, Moe's. Hamsa, 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 because there's 11, 11.1, 11 1111. Um, yeah, so if you guys missed <laughs> me and Terry Joe last night, it was kind of everything, actually. Can I be real? I'm being real, not trolling. Um, <laughs> like, I was very impressed that, like, Subscribe to chat. Yes, if you guys want to subscribe, I have a new goal. Oh, wait, I put a new goal. What happened? No, I want to make that goal. Hold on, let me add a live goal. Add new goal. Okay, whoa, okay. Oh, oh, start, okay. I don't know. All right, we added a new goal. I have over 700. Oh my God, 700 subscribers. Thank you. Woo! It's falling. Okay. What are you guys here to see? I don't know. The live last night was insane. It was so cool. Like, that he knew all the words to my song. Like, I was like, wait, was he, like, reading the lyrics? Should we play it in honor of that? I think we should, you guys. All right. Here you go. <laughs> and it's my song, so I can play it. Okay. Here we go. Also, I'm on Cameo now, so if you want to book a Cameo, I can sing I Love You Whoever. Like, if it's Savros, I can be like, I love you, Savros, and I love you, Savros. The Cameo is link in my bio, and if you guys want to subscribe to chat, link in my bio. Um, all right, here we go. In honor of Terry Joe, dedicated to Terry Joe. I said I didn't want to die. But I did. Now I know the reason why I'm still alive. It's because of the sky. Can you guess it right now? Are you wondering how? I fell in love so fast, and I know this love will last. How do I know? How do I know? He was with me from the start. He was always in my heart. Go straight far. Here you are, Jesus, my superstar. Jesus, and I love you, Jesus. You give me reason, you give me hope, and Jesus never let me go. You can act bad, or you can be good. You can be from privilege, or straight from the hood. And Jesus loves you, this we know. Never leave his side, and he'll lead you home. He's with me from the start. He was always in my heart. Though I stray far, here you are, Jesus, my superstar. Jesus, and I love you, Jesus. You give me reason, you give me hope. And Jesus, never let me go. There was a time I overdosed But I was lifted Not by the ambulance But by the Holy Ghost He took me from the start He was always in my heart Though it's straight far Here you are, Jesus, my superstar I love you, Jesus And I love you, Jesus you give me reason, and you give me hope, and Jesus never let me go. I love you, Jesus. I love you, Jesus. You give me reason, you give me hope, and Jesus never let me go. How was that, everybody? Love how the best. He's my, he's my everything. Should we do I love you, Moses? Moses. Uh, do I even have it on my phone? 
that's awkward if I don't. I love you, Moses. All right, it's on my phone. I'm gonna go to my YouTube to get it. <laughs> if you guys want cameos with I love you anything, I'll do them. <laughs> I love you, Moses. Okay, here we go. I'll do it while I'm doing my makeup so I'm double tasking. Remember when I hated life, just a queen without a throne, how could I know that my mind was gonna be blown, and it was blown. Thank you for the hat. Part of the seas, escaped from the seas, set all the sights free. I found him not before, but before he opened that door, there was a guy, a prophetical guy. Mission burning bright, not Israeli in sight. Smear the blood, pass over us, Moses, the voice of God. Moses, I love you, Moses. You freed the slaves and you freed my soul. Moses, never let me go. Here's the Hebrew, guys. Ready? Here we go. Yetziat Mitzrayim, Zarak Hahakala, Zezman Laso Tov, Astap Sehula, Avotal Kohat Pesa, Anak Numorim. Moshe, Moshe, Amare Pa'o, Shochet Amis, and Apo Ebuek, in Israeli Ba'ofek, Debatar, Im Hayel, Moshe, Ko Israel, Anio Havat Moshe, Anio Havat Moshe, Shikrata, Elibi. Moshe Hayim Tihi Asheli And now when you sit down at the Seder We'll take the way that We must always Tip the waiter Egyptian or oppressed We must always do our best no, no one above Moses, give me your love. I love you, Moses. I love you, Moses. You freed the slaves and you freed my soul. And Moses never let me go. I need your have at Moshe. I need your have at Moshe. She brought her at the be Moshe Hayim Tihi Asheli. Moshe Hayim Tihi Asheli. And you'll have it at Moshe. Okay, let me jump. I always do the most. I come down here to do like a quick makeup and then I'm like, okay. Anyways, hi chat. Hi to Sister Alicia. Sorry, I haven't been knowing. Caitlin, just subscribe. Uh, Sister Alicia. Yes, yes, yes. Can, can, can. Toda, Toda, Malibu Abba. We love Moses. We do love Moses. Thank you for the cat bras. Love our Hebrew queen. Thanks, JS Crime. Thank you for the cat paws. I think it said cat bras. Thank you for the cat paws. Okay, now there's less than 10,000 people in here and I feel a little better. I mean, it's still nerve wracking to have like 8,000, but I just, you know, I'm used to like a couple thousand, which is like cool, you know? I love that more people are watching, but also like scary. Ellie, Millie, hi, what's going on? <laughs> Okay, I can just like relax now. Whew, I felt like I needed to entertain the troops. We love Moses. Do you consider yourself Jewish or Christian? Both. I think you can totally be both because oh, why not? There was a DK last night. I know that was so crazy. That was like really, I was really like, Ooh. I couldn't even like look at the comments because I was just like, I was having fun. It was, like I said, it was like, it was really like modern day improv, right? With like, yeah, it was, it was great. I had to be careful to troll and it was I think it turned out pretty good I think so powdering my nose thank you to all the new subscribers at the subscriber only chat you guys we're not doing anything for New Year's tomorrow so I was like should I go live well I guess we could go live at like 9 o'clock our time I guess that would make sense right maybe we should go live tomorrow because like honestly so I was like, maybe we go live tomorrow. Part two with Terry. 
I would have, whatever, whenever, wherever. That was amazing. I think Terry goes live at night mostly. You are so beautiful. Thank you. I really appreciate that. Q&A. Yeah, I always can do a Q&A. <laughs> Your live with Terry was iconic. Thank you guys. Wow, you guys are so cool. Thank you. It was fun. I, like, I was glad to do it. Like, you know, we were just like in bed, about to go uh, to sleep. And I was like, yeah, it's pretty fun. Lol Bell. Oh, let me shout out the new subscribers. Thank you guys so much for subscribing. Oh my God, we're at over 700 now. Lol Bell Creative, Nathan2, the Ava Bean, E. Picello, Zohi555, Sugar Boogers, Darob, Swaggy Toes, Tessa Loop, Callie, Sampley2. K Swag for Jesus, Savros Fit, Soph Mavira, Caitlin Comes, Ariel Dunham, and Becca Webb. Thank you guys for being new subscribers. You remember so much of Elle Woods. Best compliment ever. I like loved Elle Woods as a kid. Thank you. Um, I'm trying to figure out what what look to do today. You know, like I feel like I just will do the same thing that I always do. You know. But yeah, maybe we'll do New Year's. Are you guys have any plans for New Year's? Are you guys going out? Like stay safe if you go out. Definitely stay safe. I couldn't even imagine going out now. I feel like I'd be like way too paranoid to go out. <laughs> just cause again, cause I have my daughter. I just wanna make sure I'm always with her, which I know is like, you know, you can't really always be with her, but Kenzie, thank you for so staying home with my BF. That sounds really perfect actually. A night in is very under oh, underrated. I feel like when I was in my 20s, if you guys are in your 20s feeling this way, when I was in my 20s, I felt like immense pressure to do something on New Year's Eve. Like, and if I didn't, I felt like such a loser. And I was so sad, like seeing everybody out at parties on New Year's Eve and stuff like that. But I tell you what, and like, look, the FOMO is real. I get it. Like, go do it. If you have to get it out of your system, go find a party. But if you can't find a party or you're not invited and you're just like, okay, it's not happening this year. Really, truly don't feel bad. Like, don't feel bad. My best New Year's Eves were spent at home, and I have a feeling that'll be the case this year. But maybe we'll go live. Maybe we'll go live for a little bit and, like, ring in the New Year with you guys, because how fun would that be for all the people at home, you know? Like, for all the people out, go out, enjoy yourself, but my sister's crying now. She's happy. Tap the screen. What does that mean? I'm tapping it. I don't know. I don't think that did anything. <laughs> was that right? Was that what was I supposed to do? I can't believe you're online with Terry Doe. It's crazy, y'all. That was nuts, huh? That was really fun. I was happy to be, like, you know, because probably so many people request to go live. So I was, like, happy to be, you know, chosen. <laughs> oh, I'm telling everyone to like the live. Oh, double tap the screen. Okay, yeah, everyone double tap the screen for me. Thank you. <laughs> Thanks for that. I honestly am so bad with TikTok live. Sometimes I'm like, I don't know what's what. You said yesterday you wanted to go live with her and there you were. Yeah, that was like manifestation. You guys, seriously, I know it sounds crazy. People think I sound crazy for sure. But for the people who don't think I sound crazy, like I'm telling you, when you speak something into existence, it happens. Obviously, it happened very quickly last night, but it really does happen. It's crazy. It's sometimes it happens quickly, sometimes not. But um. Let's see here. Anyone else have people harass them for weeks just for supporting Trisha? Yeah, but you know what? Here's the thing. First of all, I'm so sorry if that happens because that's like so disgusting. But I'm telling you what, those people who do harass, literally unwarranted. And also like even if it was warranted, right? Like I'm like the worst person ever. Like those people who harass like other people just for like commenting and stuff like that. I'm telling you what, like I know this firsthand and I don't wish on anyone, but that stuff comes back around. If you're harassing, 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 like law of attraction, yes. It just comes back around. And again, I'm saying this as someone who is the former them, the former hater. And not that I've ever harassed people to that level or companies or anything like that. Like that's crazy to me, like actually crazy. Um, but that that shit is not good. That's like, it, it just is. I mean, karma is so real. And how do I know? Because I've experienced really, really bad karma. And it's been really, really great karma. And it's like, I choose to try and just put out good and love and good stuff in the world. So I just get that back. And you know, just it is, but I'm sorry if anyone does get harassed. It's, it's, it's sad. It's just a few and they're loud and they create multiple accounts. I block them all the time on Twitter, like the same account saying the same thing. Living for people can change. Thanks. I mean, like people change and it's like some people are excited to see the change and then some people can't deal with the change. So 
not my problem either way. Happy birthday! Sorry, I just missed it. ASMR video with Kat. Oh, a gamer girl. Oh, totally. Oh my god, that's such a good one. I will write that down right now once I finish this other eye. I wrote that down. It's such a good idea. I have cat earphones. Okay, that's really cute though. I like that, yeah. We're almost in January, y'all. We are almost in January. Okay. I don't know what Roblox is. People always tell me to play Roblox. I don't know what that is. <sighs> okay, let's see here. Um, let's see. Okay, I'm writing it down now, gamer girl. Gamer girl cat ears. I have to look it up because I really don't know like gamer girl. Okay. Favorite foundation. I did order the Makeup Mario foundation. Mine hasn't come in yet, but I've been loving this. You can see I have multiple shades of it. This is um, the NARS, I don't know what this is, NARS Soft Matte Complete Foundation. I've been using Dualville Light. What got you into ASMR? I did ASMR way back in the day, and then my husband started doing ASMR um, 2021. And I was doing some videos on his channel and it kind of just inspired me. People were just like, oh, you should like get back to ASMR. Like I loved your ASMR so much. And I was like, really? Okay, cool. So, yeah. <laughs> were you mad in your live last night? I was so invested. No, what mad? What? Are you talking about the, um, the one with Harry Joe? Not at all. I was like so excited. <laughs> I was super, super excited about it. Let's see here. I'm trying to find. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Where is my brown? Oh, here it is. By the way, I just got a couple of new ones. Let me say hi. Ooh, La La Curves, Miss Chalamet, Kayla444, Vicarious Lurving, I think is the name. Placing Hillary Duff, yes. Yes and yes. Let me just, you know, do a little this, a little that. Let's go back, back to the beginning. Do -na 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 -na. Trying to fit a square into a circle was a lie. Oh, I let the ring fall down and wake my dreams. Let it wash away my sanity. Cause I wanna feel the thunder, I wanna sing. Let the rain fall down and come in clean. Cloud with Chelsea Lynn. I love Chelsea Lynn. I love Chelsea Lynn. At first, it's so funny. I, like, didn't get that Chelsea Lynn was a character. I really didn't. So, like, I remember at first seeing her, and it reminded me so much of where I'm from. And, like, at the time, I hated where I was from. I think it's changed a lot, and I have, I've obviously changed a lot, so it's, like, no hate to, like, where I'm from. But I, like, really at first was like, oh, my God, I can't watch this person. Like, this is literally the people in my hometown. And, again, no hate to anyone in my hometown at all or anyone who's, like, that character. Obviously, like I said, I've grown, I changed, I've become more secure with myself, but it's like I didn't want to be that for so long, and that's where I was from, so I thought that was like my fate to be. And again, there's nothing wrong, I'm really not judging it. At the time, I judged it for sure. Like, people who were like that, I was just like, oh my god, you know, like, and it's funny, it's obviously a character, but um, so I didn't know, like, she was a character for like the longest time, so I was like, always like, oh, that's, that's my hometown, it's coming back. Like, I would try and like avoid watching. No, 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 not Chelsea Lynn. Trailer Trash Tammy, who Chelsea Lynn plays. Sorry, oh my God, okay. Chelsea Lynn plays tra Trailer Trash Tammy, I was avoiding. Chelsea Lynn, I like. I mean, I don't know her in real life, but um, are you really gonna be on Real Housewives of Beverly Hills? No, it that was a troll. And I feel like that kind of trolling is like really harmless trolling. But yeah, I'm sorry to all the people that like thought that was real. Like, hey, you know what? I would never say no. Like, yeah, you know what I mean? Like, I'm. like comes up with these rumors like it's so crazy to me 
Um, and like, it's funny when people go with it. And I think it's just, I think it's just kind of funny, but do you like with Terry Joe again? Yeah. Terry Joe BFF. <laughs> Love Terry Joe. I wish I was sure. Not yet, but you never know. Sometimes you speak something into existence and it just happens whether you intend for it to happen or not. Or not. Can you sing Beetlejuice? Hey, mom, dead mom, I really need your help here. Turn that down into belong here. It was you who made me whole. Every day that's staring at me. Like, well, hurry up, go happy, move along. Forget about your mom. Cause daddy's in denial, daddy doesn't want to feel He wants you to smile and clap like a performing seal Daddy's moving forward, daddy's also smiling for real Mama, won't you send a sign? I'm running out of hope and time A flick of mice, a lightning strike Or drop a nuclear bomb No more playing daddy's game I'll go insane if things don't change Whatever it takes to make him say your name, dead mom <laughs> I'm so sad Beetlejuice is clo closing We're supposed to be going to New York in January but Beetlejuice is closing January 8th and we are not going before then, I don't think, unless something changes. But I'm so sad it's closing. I really wanted to take Moses to go see Beetlejuice because, like, ever since he's met me, like, that was my obsession. Like, my first birthday when I met him, I had, like, a Beetlejuice-themed, like, birthday thing. Um, yeah. Are you a Swifty? I wouldn't consider myself a Swifty, but I'm not an anti swifty <sighs> Thank you for the hearts. I appreciate all the hearts. The hand heart. Thank you. And all the hearts in general. Happy birthday, Bella. What's up, Bella? What's up? Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs>